Okay, on the way. Welcome to this player goes test. We're taking a look at Chuba Akpom, the 19-year-old striker. He shows today 63 overall. I remember him being pretty popular actually last FIFA, but uh, actually pretty solid this year as well. Some really good straight-up strength speed, agility, strength not too bad. But he's six-foot striker, right-footed, medium work rates. Three star weak foot and three star skill moves. So again, some pretty solid physicals with that uh, mix of pace, agility, and strength. Agility is, is solid. Uh, um, still has quite a work to do with those technical stats. The finishing, uh, dribbling, just kind of you know around the level of a 63 overall striker from the start. But uh, up to the 66 now, some good improvement in the technical areas um, and a little bit to the tack position as well. Um, but uh, nothing too huge. But his, his short passing actually was a good area. Um, he had some, a couple of, he had one or two assist I remember uh, he had some pretty solid passes throughout and I was really happy to uh, see that from him um, throughout uh, my time using him because uh, it's always nice to have a, a you know striker with some good technical ability that can not only you know score his chances but also create some chances for others but uh, up to the 73 now age 25 um, ball control drilling looking not looking too bad the finishing is all right uh, heading accuracy and again the short pass into the green now 71 um, the physical stats are looking pretty solid again still uh, I wish it was a little Bit more growth to the Jody, but uh, haven't hasn't been too much at the moment yet. But uh, scored his chances. Um, he I didn't have too many created with him. It seems like uh, I was creating a little bit more chances with uh, NJ for the most part. But uh, off the ball, he was really good. Um, made some of those runs. You can see him drawing that foul there. And here it was a very nice pass, perfectly weighted through ball. So kind of like a secondary assist uh, right there from him, creating that wonderful opportunity. Uh, you could see that little passing ability and uh, can certainly hold off defense from time to time also I didn't really have too much of that action showcased unfortunately um, these some other players seem to be kind of the, the guys you know warranting the ball a little more controlling the game a little bit more but uh, being played over the top now you can see pretty good touch uh, blowing by that defender has that good pace again and eventually uh, just well, I get a little unlucky but uh, either way <laughs> he looked very good in that little highlight being played over the top and using some of that really good straight sprint speed and also again if you hold down that L2 you can make something things happen as well being played over the top showcasing some of that pace again and I couldn't finish uh, but forget that I pass it to myself all the posts I put in the back of the net but uh, he would end up capping on age at an age 30 and doesn't cap on age 3 caps out at a 78 overall at age 30 and looking very good um, he didn't um, he unfortunately did not surpass his potential too much but still a very solid player um, I think he'd be a really good uh, kind of a rotational option uh, give you a different option off the bench as well because he has that good straight sprint speed He's pretty good agility. It went up a slightly. Uh, ball control dribbling not too bad. He's some good finishing, heading accuracy, short passing as well to go with that six foot frame. Not too bad in the attack position either. Either so uh, certainly a good option, especially in Road to Glory style career modes. With that, guys, thanks for tuning in. I'll be signing out now, and I'll catch you guys later.